What's up everybody and welcome back to the episode of Project Complete. It's time to take care of one of the biggest pet peeves about this deck truck. Also, we still have the subscriber giveaway going on, so if you want to win a lovely maintenance package that looks something like this, All you have to do is be one of my subscribers at the time of the end of the giveaway. And let's get back to the video. So right now we're gonna head to the store real quick. Uh, I need to pick up some hardware for this project. Now this is just kind of an impromptu project for me. I've had the parts forever. I just haven't actually had the time to install it. But um, today I was at Costco picking up some shelving units and um, I just couldn't take it anymore. So if you guys have seen one of my latest videos, it was all about the deck system. I did pros and cons on it and I did the install of it. Now, um, there are a couple things I like about it and a couple things I don't like about it. Um, don't get me wrong, this isn't a bash on the deck, but I really do like having it in my truck. It's just the one thing that is really a pet peeve of mine is that they took all of my bed mounts. So all the bed mounts are used to mount, mount the actual system, which just annoys the hell out of me. It wouldn't be so bad if they took the bed ties away and then gave you something to tie on to. But they don't. They make it so you have to purchase extra bed ties. I don't know, it's been about a little under a year that I've had the, the deck system. I really do like it. I really do like the storage it offers. Um, there's a couple things that I don't like about it. One of them is being a slick top and and not being completely waterproof. But my the major pet peeve of mine is that you know, I don't have any bed ties now. That's what we're doing right now. We're gonna head to the store and pick up some hardware. All right, so here's what I got. It's a 10 pack of the seven Sparta V tie down anchors. Single hole, heavy duty, and it's rated up to 1,500 pounds. I got six of these, six nylon half inch, six stainless steel marine grade half inch, six stainless steel marine grade one and a quarter half inch bolts. And for tools, get this job done, three quarter inch ratchet, quarter inch drive for the Milwaukee impact and then center punch masking tape, which I'll show you where that goes and three quarter inch just open end Step bits and the trusty Milwaukee drill. All right, so I'm gonna do six. I'm gonna do One right here in this center column one right here in this bump out And another one in this bump out right here in order to get that I gotta remove this I start right here and slowly pry up, try not to break any of the tabs. Don't know if I'm gonna be able to get one in the center bump out. You can get there this way. Open end doesn't really fit down there, so might have to drill out this hole a little bit. We'll see. The ones at either side of the bed are going to be the easiest because there's this big hole right here. I could also get there by taking out this tail light. But I'm going to use the center punch and then drill it out with the step bit. Here's the plan. Bolts, tie down, washer, and then lock nut. Now in order to get the lock nut in there, take these tape, sticky side up, and then push the nut down in there. Now hold your nut in place, you can fish it through, and then tighten the bolt.
open and the socket side doesn't fit in there. guys like this video and I hope it helped you out. If you're wondering about any of the products in this video, feel free to check the links in the description down below for you.